Hey guys, I just want to show you quick how to take apart your GE top load washer. The front and the top. So first thing you'll need to do is, there's two clips here. One here and one here between the front panel and the top panel. You can either use a putty knife to push those clips in and pull the bottom door out. Like that. Or if you don't have one of these handy, you could try using a flathead screwdriver. A small one that can go in there. Just press down in there and it should pop right out. Then on the bottom, you got two lips right there. That's what the front panel holds on. Just take that out. We can set that aside. And then to take the top off, you just take out these two quarter inch screws on either side. And the top should come right off. Got to play with it a little bit. There you go. And usually there's angled lips, if you can see that right there. You kind of have to pull the top to the left to get them off. And then that will come right off like that. And of course you can't take it off all the way because you have your door switch hooked up to it. So be careful not to yank this top off. If you want, you can just set it back like this just to see what's going on inside of here. Um, in my case, my tub was banging around real loud. So if you can see, there's these four rubber straps that kind of hold the tub in place. So I found that one of mine is ripped neatly in half. That's probably why the tub is banging. So I'll just need to replace one of these and should be good to go. And that's how you take it apart. And to put it back together, um, you go backwards basically. You put the tabs in first in the top, slide them to the right, like that. And then you gotta get, this is kind of a tricky part, you gotta get this to slide in. That's hard to explain, you're just gonna have to try it. You gotta get, have it slide into a slot that's in the back there. Once you see it, you'll believe it. Then put the screws back in. Put the bottom door back on, the front panel. Starting from the tabs in the bottom there, the lips. Align it in the center. Then there's these two plastic tabs on either side. That goes in there as well. You line those up. And then you just snap it back in place. And your washer is back in one piece. Hopefully this helps somebody. Thank you so much for watching. Have a nice day.